everyone, this is Dr. Carly Squires and I'm here with Audiology Services of West Virginia and today I'm going to show you how to change the wax filter in your hearing aid. So most hearing aids now have what's called a wax filter, a wax guard, you may have heard it called a wax trap. Um, those are just ways that we can help to clean the device at home um, with the tools that are given by the manufacturer. So I'm going to go through that with you today. The first type of device I'm going to show you is a custom hearing aid. So this would be an in the ear or in the canal or completely in the canal hearing aid that's made from a custom ear, um, ear mold impression. And if you notice on the end that goes into your ear, there is a little white circle. This is the wax filter and I'm going to show you how to change that today. Reasons that you may need to change that would be if you are noticing a weak sound quality from your device or if it's not working at all, definitely check the battery, but you could also check here. If this gets plugged with wax or debris or skin, that's going to block the sound from actually going into your ear and prevent you from hearing the way that you should. So what you'll do if you need to change this little filter is you will grab this case that comes with your hearing aids you're going to open it and this will be full of little sticks and that will be how you change the filter. So I'm going to grab one out of here and if you notice on the stick there's one end that is a blank and then the other side has a new filter in it. So I'm going to take the side that's blank and I'm going to insert it into the end of the hearing aid where that filter sits and I'm just pushing it in there. I'm not turning it or twisting it and I'm pulling out and that, that filter is going to come out and be on the end of the stick. And there's no filter in the hearing aid. We're going to turn this over and insert the new one just by pressing in and pulling out. That's going to stay in there. This stick can then be disregarded and then I'm just going to push down make sure it's secure. The same method will be used with a receiver in the canal hearing aid attached to a custom ear mold. You will pull a stick out, you'll remove the filter, and you'll turn it over and insert the new filter into the other side. It's a little bit different if you have a receiver in the canal hearing aid that does not have a custom ear mold on the end. Um, and that way there's a dome that you have to remove to actually get to the filter. And to do that, I'm just going to take my fingers and grip onto this and pull the dome off. That exposes the filter. From here, the steps are the same. You would just take one of the sticks from this case. And then you would use this end that does not have a, a filter on it to collect the old one. So press in, pull out, turn it over, press the new filter into the receiver and pull back out. Make sure it's secure, disregard the stick, and then place the dome back onto the receiver. So in general, that is, those are the steps that you'll follow to change the filters. Now there are some manufacturers that use a tool that looks like this. And this little piece actually attaches here. It has a threaded end, which is what you will use to collect the, the filter from your hearing aid. And what you'll do in a device that uses this kind is you'll just line that up. You'll turn this into the filter and pull out, and then the filter will be on the end of the stick. To get rid of that filter, you will place it in the center of the case and pull over to the side, pull that out, and that filter will stay in here. You'll turn the stick over and to collect a new filter you will use this dial. You'll turn it, press this here. When you pull out the new filter will be sitting on the end of the stick and then we'll, you will use that to insert it into the receiver. So I hope that helped you today if you need some guidance on changing a filter on a hearing aid. If you have additional questions, please call our office or send us an email at info, I-N-F-O, at hearwv.com. Thanks.